I see WEX4 investigation mission and challenge mode. To complete the mission for this stage, you have to complete normal mode whilst having the gravity switches switched at least five times. Note, at least, not at most. So the devs really know how to make me suffer. Anyways, the squad. Chongyu as essential, Spectre can be replaced by anyone who can deal with the kitchen knife and the lightsaber. And it does take a lot to deal with the lightsaber, so if you don't have anyone that can do that, you can also bring an extra burst damage dealer to kill them at the end. The other operators can be replaced by better operators you have in the same branch, and for the remaining slots, if you are trying to do the mission, if you are trying to do the mission in normal mode, you can bring some extra faster deploys to switch the switches. And if you are doing challenge mode, just bring some high damage dealers to deal with the last wave, which is just so fucking hard. Anyways, let's start. Oh yeah, and uh, Skadi, or Sculter, she can buff Chongyu's damage by a lot. Deploy Courier here. Now you want to deploy Gravel immediately and then retreat her. Same thing for Yaro on the bottom. If you don't have enough DP to pull this off, uh, you can also just hold off on it and do it later. This means you need to bring more fast redeploys to do it. But uh, yeah, you can do it, uh, do it later too. Now deploy Gravel again to start this guy. And deploy Gavio here and don't forget to back Beichongyue to get a skill ready. And as you can see, the DP pressure at here is very high for Korra, so you can bring some flag guards if you want to, or just hold off on the first wave of Fadula play deploying. That would work fine too. Alright, you want to retreat Gravel when the lightsaber guy comes up. The lightsaber guy has already come up and Gravel is killed, so everything's fine. Now just hack the Chongya skill. And uh, deploy Hibiscus here. Deploy Gravel here to deal with that shield guy's shield. What else? You don't need to start these guys because Chongya can kill them. Yep. Once that shield guy is dead, you want to retreat Gravel and then deploy Yaro here to trigger the switch for the fourth time. Yeah, fourth time. And that's going to be the fifth time. And the mission's done. Now you can deploy, say, Gravel again to deal with that guy's shield. And once those shields are dealt with, you can retreat Gravel and the uh, Courier. Deploy Spectre here facing left. If you're using a ranged guard, you can face them upwards and then deploy Jatano here facing up. And uh, deploy Noakorn here facing up too. Wait, we don't need to use Noakorn yet. Deploy Yaro here to press down that switch so that the defenders on the bottom do not press down the green switch. Yes. Now at 30, 34 kills, there will be lightsabers spawning. Once those lightsabers spawn, that means the shield guys before them on the last of one of their kind in this stage. And that means you can retreat Yaro once they pass the green button. So the lightsaber guys have spawned, so you can retreat Yaro once those shield guys have passed the green button right now. And activate Yotano's skill to deal with those shield guys because this is the highest pressure wave, in which even Chongyue cannot deal with them. So you just want to star as much as possible, so that you can finish this wave. Also activate Spectre's skill to deal with these guys. Just keep on starting on the bottom, because that is a lot of damage, and a lot of enemies. Yes. There we go. That's done. Hope this helped. Thanks for watching. And bye.
hope this. I, I say that already. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm not thinking straight anymore because this stage was hard. Yep. Bye.